Hello and welcome to Lights of Venus. In this session, we'll work on developing your claircognizant skills. Claircognizance, or in other words clear knowing, is the ability to receive psychic information via thought. This thought is either sent by those in spirit via telepathy, or it is channeled from the global consciousness by your higher self. You can receive claircognizant messages anywhere, at any time, like taking a walk, having a shower, or before falling asleep. Let's look at some examples of this clair ability. Try to remember when you last experienced one of those aha moments. You know, the moment when you finally get an idea on how to fix that problem that's been bugging you for a while. You don't know how you managed to come up with such a great solution when you weren't even thinking about it. All you know is that it was absolutely correct without any hesitations. Under the psychic ability of clear knowing, we may also categorize precognition, strong sense of right and wrong, and the ability to mentally scan people's personalities. All of these come to you as sudden thoughts or ideas, and based on particular situation, they are either subtle and hardly noticeable, or intense, repetitive and too powerful to ignore. And what are the benefits of claircognizance? For example, you'll be better at problem solving, recognizing when someone's lying to you, and giving better advice to the people close to you. In psychic development, it is the recognition of subtle energetic information that we want to bring to the front and learn to be more aware of. Therefore, we'll be using a meditative state, because in meditation, we're naturally more sensitive to this kind of perception. First, you learn how to open up to receiving psychic information claircognizantly, and then we'll work on exercising your precognition skills. For the best results, I would suggest doing this exercise in the late evening hours. So, if you're ready, please find a quiet place, turn off your lights, and feel free to sit or lay down in a comfortable position where you can relax. Let's begin. Take a couple of deep breaths to help you relax your body and mind. Let go of the outside world just for this moment. Relax. Get comfortable and center yourself. All that matters is right here and right now. Be mindful of each breath you take.
inhale and exhale. Inhale, exhale. Each breath helps you relax just a little more as it gets deeper and slower. Breathe in again. And breathe out. Forget the future. And forget the past. Surrender to the present moment. Let go completely. And free yourself from all your thoughts and emotions that are present in your mind. Imagine them gradually evaporating off your body. Give your mind time and space to calm down. And remember, you are safe in this moment. There is no rush, no stress, no problems. It's just you as you are present and focused. Now you can let your eyes gently close and invite silence and tranquility into this darkness you see in your inner vision. No need to panic or worry. Just relax. Allow yourself to get immersed in this calming relaxation as if it were the ocean waves gently brushing against your body. Imagine you can feel it on your legs and feet. On your arms and hands. On your back. And at the back of your head, making you feel completely limber and at peace. In order to use your claircognizant ability, you need to keep an open mind and keep your crown chakra open and balanced. 
The crown chakra is an energy center situated around the top of your head and is essential in connecting your physical body to your higher spiritual bodies, to the spirit world, and thus to the global and cosmic consciousness. You receive most of your psychic information through this center first, and which is then sent further to your other chakras, for example to your third eye or your solar plexus. As a skilled psychic, you'll be keeping your crown chakra open at all times. In the learning stages, a good way to open it up on demand is through an intention in a prayer, affirmation or visualization. In this session, we will try the visualization technique. Let's get right into it. Imagine you can feel the top of your head open up. Once it's fully opened, visualize a funnel of light attached at the top of your head. The funnel begins to grow upwards and leads all the way up to the skies, through the astral planes, and connects right to the source, the heavens, or the earth consciousness if you like. Now that you're firmly connected, you may begin to sense the spiritual information gradually making its way into your mind. You can feel it as it sends tingles through your body, starting with your head and reaching down towards your feet and toes. This feeling is exhilarating and refreshing. You can feel the universal love and wisdom touch every inch of your body. You may notice a bright yellow light appear above your head while keeping your eyes closed. For the next few minutes, keep visualizing this image and focus on the feelings you get from connecting to the source. This will help you learn to tune into spirit and open up and strengthen your claircognizant skills.
And now as a practice, ask the Source, the Angels, your Spirit Guides or your loved ones in Spirit to send you spiritual information in the form of a thought. This information will most likely be relevant to you personally or to those close to you. And it may be a solution to a problem or an inspirational idea. Allow them to connect with you through your claircognizant ability and just wait patiently and quietly. Try not to think too much and instead relax and embrace the present quietness. Wait for a thought to come to mind. This thought will speak directly to your heart and soul. You might even get goosebumps all over your body. In the last part, let's have a look at precognition. Precognition is in other words the prediction of future. Remember that the future is relative and always revolves around one's free will. Even true psychic precognition is usually 80% accurate as there is always room for life to take a completely different route. The prediction of future can be generally accessed through any of your psychic abilities. However, the most important and the strongest is a clear knowing that this information is true. The ability of precognition ranges from knowing you're going to get a phone call from your friend to the prediction of future global events. Usually, precognition provides insight into smaller, day-to-day -day events that can help you lead a stress-free, spiritual and healthy life. Let's try a simple exercise to forecast the weather. Ask the source in your mind. What will the weather be like tomorrow? Let your conscious mind rest, stay as quiet and calm as possible, and see what thoughts come through from the Spirit.
keep in mind when doing this exercise that it's better to get no thoughts at all than making up something yourself consciously. We can predict a thousand things using our conscious mind and barely get half of it right without the use of claircognizance. On the other hand, letting your subconscious mind receive intuitive information is much more accurate. Keep on practicing your claircognizant skills and most of all, try to observe how you feel when you receive thoughts in your mind. What is different about the information you receive from the spirit world? How does it feel to you? Does it feel like it's coming from a source other than your own mind? And also try to pay more attention in your everyday life. If any thoughts come to mind that you feel may be substantial, Take notice, and maybe even write them down, as they can be very beneficial to you later on. One of the first signs of claircognizance opening up is seeing repeating numbers, like triple one or triple three. These are most commonly seen on digital clocks. These experiences mean that those in spirit are connecting with you through your claircognizant ability. I hope you enjoyed this guided exercise. Thank you for your time today, and I'll see you in our next Psychic Development series.